going to show today how I like to put on a horse bridle. Now today we're going to use a standard western bridle with a curb chain and your typical kind of curb bit with a port. I like to be certain that I have my bridle prepared where the curb chain is undone from one side so we give the horse all that freedom to be able to put this piece in his mouth without any restriction. I found most horses are difficult to bridle because we haven't helped them and prepared the equipment properly. I'm going to take his halter off, keeping myself next to him at his shoulder. Then I bring my hand around and I put a little bit of pressure as I stroke his nose to kind of put him in a position where it's comfortable. I then replace my right hand with my left, applying a little more pressure. As I inch the bridle up to him, he either will accept it and open his mouth, or I may have to put my right thumb into that corner where there are no teeth. I slowly bring the bit up as I continue to maintain pressure with my left hand, fold his right ear over, fold his left ear over, and get everything organized. Then I like to make sure the chain is not twisted, it's lying flat against his curb. I place the end where it needs to be properly placed. Your curb strap or chain is always placed in the same hole or near the hole where the cheek piece is. That's important for the leverage and the working function of that bridle and bit. So that's how I would apply that bridle. We have a number of different kinds of bridles in the way that they're designed, but this is a very simple working kind of bridle and the technique works very well for me.